Yeah. That's the roof side, is it? Yeah. And this bottom bit goes under. <clears throat> What was this designed for? I don't know. No idea why. Okay, it just it happened to fit perfectly. I should be like wagging. Yeah. But it just seems to fit okay. I would say more than okay. It's pretty. Well, I ordered one. I'm like, pretty bloody really cool. Well, I'm <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that's why no water was running out. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I've got. I bought a. I'd, uh, did you bring the bottle? I, I did. I bought one, I think. Yeah. And I bought a bottle. I sh Chris has shouted me like two or three times, so I'm like, I'll buy a bottle of Jim Beer <laughs> this time. Yeah, like how's better. <laughs> Welcome back to another All Terrain Action video. This video is an extended part one upload, preparing my wife for the Simpson Desert trip later this year. This is her first time forward driving on sand, so apologies ahead for any experienced watchers. This video was not intended to be informative, more just our briefed vlog of events for the afternoon after arriving at camp on day one. Just the just the pressure, no 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 air's getting in there so I can't push up the pipe really. You're pushing it up, so Yeah, so you're pushing it up, but then when you let go of it, wouldn't it, it Oh no, because once it gets below that then it would suck the air back in. That's correct. But once you tip it, there's no air getting in up here for it to allow it to actually come up the tube. But if you yeah. open that lid it would. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, do you want the back shot? No, just leave it. Other thing? Right, we'll straight while you were all over. Are we, are we going out? I'm going to admin that. Weird. Yeah, now the wider the tyre, it all works on footprint size. Yeah. Right? But it's also capacity so as well, they said. We saw it. Yeah. You'd be, oh, yes, you'd be so 15 as well. Yeah, so I'd be probably 15, 16, yeah. It was yeah. higher than it should have been. Like it's like hot It's not cold. Um, but it is. And the wheels will probably well, it would be pretty. The, the tires the would line. be cold now, yeah. 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 I'm like, that is not legal. No, oh, you're saying that 15 hot. 15 hot. Like, I don't think so I'd be. be so when you start to, and they say, wait until your tires warm up, you should avoid it's turning it. It's weird. I'm going to start at 15 feet. cold. It's only a couple. Which would be 17, probably. Like, I struggle to get in that. The adventure goes up about 5 psi. I'm on 36 like cold, but as soon as I'm on the highway, I'm at 40. Wow, that's yeah. a lot. Yeah. Again, again, that again must be the size of tyres. Yeah. Pardon? You won't do that in the sand. You won't get warm, uh, will it? No, not that hot. It'll get hot because of the sand's warm. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. But They're not like no highway tar map friction. Yeah, the tyres sometimes get to 100 degrees Celsius, you know? And you're driving on it, your tyres are going to get hot. What's that, Wyatt? Yeah, turn it out. Yeah. How far away is the track down there? Yeah, no, no, I'm more thinking if we're going to lower, if we're going to put them down now, we'd only be able to go 40 k's now on the tar. Yeah. Oh, well, it depends what we're doing. There's no point doing them back up if we're back out on the tracks in the morning. Down low. Holy, the colour. Alright, let's do that. When you, it was funny, when you said 14, well, 15, I'm like, wait a minute. And then I thought, no, wait, sand, that's different again. <laughs> so I used to do an 18 to 20. <laughs> I was actually looking at it, watching you going, shit, it's actually taking you a while to do those. <laughs> You're so used to it being so that quick. Yeah. That's why mine takes so long. Um, that doesn't help a person either. What are you guys doing? You're going to go for a, a bit of a... Um, like nah, nah. That protein shake is... Oh. Yeah. I'm um, about to give Sarah it a makes crash. Makes you very full. She's on her own tomorrow. With Will up front. I'll jump in the passenger seat. That's a scary thought. So Will's going with Will? You can see. Yeah. Will's going to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I was definitely going you through. Can go yeah, that cat, watched, that shake that I had I would have more the, no, more sorry, I mean the calories yes, than yeah. what you're having now. So it's like a it's like a full terrible. meal and then some. Right? Like the What's that? Is dad, your dad's coming with you. Oh, dad's coming. Yeah, dad okay. Don't listen. Yeah. Don't listen. No, I was thinking. I was thinking about something else. <laughs> have you got a spare seat in your car? I'm sitting. No. With Sarah's driving. No, Sarah's in with. The back. Oh yeah, wife can come. No, Dang don't. It, oh, yeah, come here, come along, why not? I don't want Wyatt. Oh, right. I, 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 that's why I'm riding yeah. <laughs> You're nuts. Oh, better yet, I'll be in the back seat and watch YouTube for a f***ing <laughs> 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 this will be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> You're I'll teaching Sarah. <laughs> the diamond sword. What happens when you get stabbed with the diamond sword? 
I just sit back and enjoy the uh, trip. Can ask the question you? Mm. Alright, so what I reckon... It just means late at bedtime, but sleeping in the morning. Late starts. <laughs> well, this Jay, track is just... If you exit where we just came in, just up ahead, there's actually a track, apparently, that goes towards that other track we saw coming in. Uh, the netting bed. Yeah. a little nervous. Yeah. Yeah, that's right, because it goes back at an angle. Your tyres are down, you it have plenty of grips, and I'll be going first too. So if we hit any soft, soft sand, you'll just have to pull. I've got my retrieval point in, so if it goes soft, soft, you'll be able to just pull me straight back out, and we just, we'll work it out. Yep. Do you want some of this? Go up, down, back. Okay, well, what do you want? Is that a road, is it? That's the main road. That's the main road. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, we so we're going track, up through the track we saw. Yeah. We came in this way. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So that was what we saw uh, there. Yeah. I know. Not the. Oh Jesus! Well. What happened? Let's go back out to the main road. Oh shit! Will. That's that tire. Did he keep himself a flat tire? Yeah. Well, that didn't take long. Okay, flat tire. Alright, just let me get help. Something else. It's oh, it's completely broken. The tire. Well, that's not Bottom. good. Bottom. Well, I'm not going to be doing any four wheel driving today. Or for this week. Why? Because my spare tire is the wrong size. I haven't got a new spare. Yeah, I'll spare tire. Is that the same size? Yes, it is. I mean, that leaves us without a spare tire. But... It doesn't ruin our trip. We're on sand. Yes. Like, unless we hit something like that, it's, we're probably not going to need it. Actually, uh, Will, Sarah has a good point. You could probably use our spare. Yours is... Ours is 17, but the size rolling diamond is very similar. It's 0 0.01 off. And it's six stud. And I think it, I think the studs are the same. Yeah, stud pattern should be the same. It just depends on the offset. No, but I'm looking at, I'm looking at those, and it's the I'm same. Six, that, six. Uh, I think there's a 15 difference between our model and your model. Mine are offset, but I don't think that'll make it. Will my positive offset be an issue? No, I'm, we've just I'm positive 25 on my sets. I don't know if that'll make an issue, but you can use our spare like because if if we get another flat, one way or another, go we've got to get another one anyway somehow. So you reckon this size is actually very similar? It should be. It's probably more similar than now. Thir it should be thirty-one point six. Is it my thirty-one point eight or something? Yes, there is point yeah. something off, but it's within within Five ten five percent even. Yeah. See, I right. have good go ideas. for it, mate. They Undo the nuts. Just don't listen to it. It looks like it's about that like. Yeah, we got to watch, watch his top um, bull joint. Well, we, we'll find out in a minute. How yeah, much too live? Bit up more. God. Yeah, it needs to go up. You sure that jack's on a good spot? Yeah, that jack is about as safe as ever gonna be. Okay. And that's. You sure? Because that, Cause that no looks. To, there's nowhere to jack on the front of these. That's the trouble I found that out at home. Just be careful, Will, if, if the car was to slip. That old okay, corner right. will come on your fingers. Your hand, yeah. Take your hand right, pull the tire right out. That's it, yep. That's it, just like Because your dad will realise what's going on, but you may not straight away. And the only thing is if it rolls backwards, we're in trouble. Just in case, because it'll come down and it'll come your way. All right, go try it again. Right on the bottom, remember? Yeah. <laughs> it's not grinding. That's good news. It's good enough. Good Should be fine. See how that goes. <sighs> okay, now you can put the rest of the nuts on. <laughs> Here you go. Enjoy. Yep, pillows. Back goes fine. Alright. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're just, we're coming. Maximum speed with low pressures. You turn around like me. Probably like. 20 for now. Which is what I said. You go a little bit higher, but let's go 20 for now. It's it's a heat thing more than anything else. Uh, hard braking, avoid it too, especially on tarmac while you're low pressures. Yep. And slow down when I'm going 
Yeah. It's, be it's better to come off the accelerator and slow down than it is to use Brake. the brakes. Yes. Yep. Okay, so we want to go into low range now. Yep. So what are you going to do? Come to a complete stop. On your dash. And it will have That's a full on. low. It should be an orange light. I can't see with my sunny thing. Yeah, it's on. Yeah. Oh. It's much more rigid. VSC disabled. Yeah, don't worry about it. It's all the safety features. It turns them all off. Cause... Now what do I do? Just drive. Just drive. Just drive. That's what you have to do. Normal. Just normal. All what, the, all the, the because you're in low range. The, the shifts are more firm. Oh, okay. Now if you're if you're on sand, okay, you 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 move. You've got a momentum forward. Mm. It's like a boat. Remember? Go with the momentum. Yeah, no, no. If you want to turn, you need you need to be still powering the wheels. The wheels are only going to turn the direction if you're if you're in motion. If so you hit the brakes and try and turn, you're not going to go the direction you want. So drive into the power, basically. No, power into the direct drive, really, the other way around. You want to power your turns. So turn as I'm yeah. driving. So if you if you, something goes wrong and you're going towards a direction you don't want to go, braking's not the key. You need yeah. to come back on the accelerator and steer to the direction you want to go. And don't steer hard. The more hard you steer, the more less likely you're going to come back on track. So You've it's, got kind to gradual. Like, it's kind of like the opposite on a road when um, you lost control, you take your foot off the accelerator. A little bit. Yeah. At the end of the day, if you're not confident and you're not sure what's about to happen and you don't know what to do, but don't the, first instinct, the, the first instinct to stop, then just brake and come to a stop. But you'll probably get stuck. That's still better than making a mistake and maybe going off an edge and then rolling down on a weird angle. Yep. But if you're confident, you understand how the car is going to respond to your inputs. That's you're going the wrong way. I want. I need to go left. Jump on the accelerator gently and steer left and accelerate. And you'll feel the car slowly pull. That's if I'm not going in the direction that I want to go. Well, that's just basically if you ever want to go a direction. You always want to power with it generally. Sand is a weird thing, and it took me forever to kind of work that out. But at least with this car, you don't have to worry about gears being in the butt gear or anything like that. Try to stay in the ruts because I don't want to. Yeah, that's fine. Go. The car will often steer itself, following the track that's in front of you. So if you just take your hands off a little bit of steering wheel and accelerate, does it go the direction following the track? Let it go. Let it go. See? See how it's like a train, like a railway yeah. line. Yeah, it's fine. Are we got we coming? Um. Hang on. Yes. Yep. Okay. I didn't bring many batteries because I didn't realise that we were <laughs> doing this. It's good because this is not that soft, so I don't have to navigate that entry. Well, yeah, it's good you're getting one or the other at the moment, so you can. <laughs> but if this has taught me anything while full driving, and this generally only gets worse. Oh, this one's going to be difficult. Sorry, right, keep going. There you are. Oh god, I probably just made it worse. Go. No, that's steep. No, because there's one on this side too. Okay. Oh. And there's a tree there. I should probably try and avoid it. Oh, just... Am I going to hit that? Just watch, watch your... Yeah, I can see that. Okay, yeah, keep going. You're plenty of room on my side. You're going to hit the roof. That's yeah, fine. the roof you can't see. You can definitely hear it. <laughs> Shit. There's nothing I can do about that one. It's fine. <laughs> Go away. Okay, so I've got two options here. You have to keep going, but we could be... Yeah, it could be, you know, over an hour to back to camp. Or you can turn around and maybe half an hour back, but... Yeah, okay. Why, how did you come up with that now after we started it? I don't know where they're going. Okay. Going back just sounds like more scratches. Going forward also sounds yeah, like the more problem scratches. with forward. 
shaped. <laughs> it's an aerial. Yeah, the aerial I'm not worried about. They'll just flex. Can you? Oh, Can shit. Can you get out and hold it back? Nah. It's... Okay. Yeah, Captain, we're going to do. What are you doing? Yeah. Ah. Uh, keep going. Just keep going. Yeah, should we have to get past this? Should we play? Yeah. Let him know yeah. yeah. Just let me get out for a second. <clears throat> Come on. <laughs> what the f are you going to do? I did. I did. Did warn you, and it's only getting worse. So, I mean, it could get better too. Nah, we don't know. Nah, it's not better. Fine. It's not gonna get better. Yeah. Yeah. Let's through. turn back. Yeah. Keep just coming. Back now. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Just slowly. Just keep coming. You're under a meter. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. I should actually be able to reverse straight and yeah. drive out. <laughs> yeah, this track goes for 15 kilometers. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yep. Just go that way more. Let's go that way more. Steer away from it, not into it. Yeah. Steering away from Yeah. All the ones on that side, I'm not going to be able to see this one. Yeah. One pitfall. Okay. Yeah, just go that way more a little bit. Yep. Yeah, because yeah, I said, how long does this actual track go for? 15 kilometers. Like, you really. <laughs> you see how much you're turning the wheel? I can see. You gotta pay attention. You, we, let's just say it was that wasn't full lock though. I know, but I want you to look at how much you're turning the wheel because I don't think you realise the car, how much you're turning is a lot more than what you probably need, especially when the sand's like this. You ever see it? See, look what's happening because you're going slow, right? Yeah. But look how much you're turning. You're turning too much. Yeah. So you've got to you've got to come out of this. You have got to break that habit. Okay. So, so you can keep driving up. See if you can drive up more. Because you're going to have to accelerate in reverse quite a bit to get your direction you want, right? Yep. So reverse and then yep. move, start moving and then turn and power up because your car's not going to start going the direction until you got power at your wheels. What's behind me? Nothing. It'll just. Yeah. Well, I shouldn't say nothing because there could be, but. No, 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 no. It's just something. Oh, that's <laughs> a bush. Seriously? It's not going to do anything. Um, can I get them to get this over the app on my tablet? Pardon? Can I get them to get Not right now. Too slow, says, and too much turn. Okay. Okay. I can, the problem is, when I'm turning, I can't actually see this. I understand. Oh, yeah, yeah, I understand that. I'm really disappointed we're not actually getting stuck. Okay. There's branches here. And I'm still Avoid them. I'm still turning too much. I don't you know. can no, you can turn a lot, but I just want to know how much you're actually turning for what you what you're actually getting on the sand. Oh, because I need to turn more because I'm going slower. It's hard it in a way, but also I want you. You need to know how, because you turn. You're on a road. If you were to turn like that, you would turn much more than yeah. what you're actually turning on the sand. And you can feel it. You feel the car yeah. floating around like that. It's hard when you're reversing though. It's different. Yeah. <clears throat> so in that situation, do I just turn my wheel a little bit and then power into the reverse the same way that I would go forward? So you can turn really sharply, but only if that's your only option because you can't turn less. Could I have turned less there? You could have. You could have done more point turns than turn less. Okay. Because the problem with you're turning too much for not enough power. Because so what happens is... You can turn... If you can, if you can power more, you can turn less. But really? ideally, if you have to... If you really, if you really have to go sharp, you have to give it a lot of power. Because yeah. you need to force the wheels to turn to move the car that way. Yeah. What you were doing, you were actually pushing the sand to the side of the tyres and not actually going anywhere. Okay. 
So if you were on an edge, a really dangerous drop edge there, you could very well fall, start going down the way you don't want to go, which is why if you have to turn sharply, which is why I wanted to get stuck, and then I could have shown you the difference, what how the car will perform differently. Yeah. But it's um well, I'm actually very surprised. I think the the, the float, the low PSI on the tires is amazing. He's not even sinking. He's just flattening out the sand. I was watching the ground you drove on. Sorry, our looks on our faces when we scratched the car. Ah, oh, look. You and me looked at each other in Toyota. We go, you know, we, you realise this is going to get scratched, whether we like it or not. <laughs> Yeah, like off-roading, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, but I said that about the, the adventure I have. Where is it? No, you said you weren't going to take it off-roading. Well, see, that's even worse. Okay, so how about Turning right. They're saying, go onto the, go onto the road, go onto the left side and drive along the gravel 